In the summer of 2021, I bought every single Life Before 26650 on AliExpress that I could find, but then I got burned out. Now I'm feeling a little bit better and I finally have the time to test and review them. All the tests are done in the Sky RC MC3000, which is a really good individual cell tester. Let's start with the lithium battery e-bike battery store. They actually brought batteries on the label, which is good, but they packed it in simple bubble wrap, should have some additional protection. And I also bought the red YIT cells, not the blue ones. These YIT cells also write battery on the label, but they only have simple bubble wrap as protection. The store name is called BTR Hak Adi Battery Store. The A123s I bought from something called Iconstreal Store, which both sounds like steel and conceal, which would have made me more suspicious. <laughs> they also wrote electronic parts on the label, not batteries. It was wrapped in uh, plastic bubble protection, but that's not really enough to ship lithium ion batteries. It's not hard to tell that these rewrapped A123s, most likely old stock, rewrapped, and some of the cells even have different heat shrink tubings and different colors so so let's go on with the hexon cells these were the most expensive even more expensive than the fake a123s these hexon cells i had really high hopes for but they wrote adapter on the box not batteries but they added a battery they were both from the hexon official profile on aliexpress and they were very well packed with padding and individual plastic wrappers and a really nice cardboard box and they look really nice with that black tube the sunshine batteries were bought from GH Fage and they, and they actually wrote batteries on the label and they had the absolute most luxurious packaging of all a nice printed box and in that a nice plastic case for all the four cells and the price were really cheap. This was bought from Mr. Lee's official and both were called Mr. Lee even though some of them were YIT and the packaging was decent they actually wrote battery and had a battery label 4000 milliampere hour cells were actually 26700 so they were a little taller than the other ones. So let's start with the bad. AliExpress is not a good place for genuine products and it's very hard to prove you, that you have gotten fake sales since the sellers can actually buy fake certificates that will instantly close any dispute to their advantage. A123 looked like they were genuine at first glance but after closer inspection they have clearly been rewrapped by hand. Also the heat shrink tubing have different colors of green and they were not perfectly aligned. This is most likely original A123 since it's very hard to fake this exact design but it's definitely old stock maybe even used still performed at a decent capacity depending if you count them as 2400 or 2500 milliampere hours but definitely not a good purchase a123 is basically the only known brand 26650 life before cells since sony stopped producing their 26650 version since makita took over the battery factories but so shine is however a brand that's common on aliexpress that some people might recognize it's ex extremely well packed and well presented in a perfect way but that was more or less makeup for their inferior product that only tested about 70 to 75 percent of the rated capacity at one amps and that makes them the worst purchase of all so let's move on to the hexon cells which looked very promising and they were super expensive, but it didn't even have 100% of the low 3200 milliampere hours at 1 amp, just about 92 to 95%, so clearly not a good option price wise. However, the second place goes to Mr. Lee's 40E, which came very close to delivering the 4000 milliampere hour promised at a decent cost. First prize, however, is awarded to YIT. 
They're also sold as SLNI by Mr. Lee and that was the only cell that actually reached the promised capacity in most of the tested cells. The 4 I got from Mr. Lee however had lost some of the voltage. One was down under 2 volts I excluded that one from the test. But all cells have been sitting on my shelf for more than 15 months so that is most likely why.